Avatar Studios is the best decision Nickelodeon has made in a long time. It turns out, there's a lot more to come. Avatar The Last Airbender and The Legend of Korra gave us seeds of a world that was filled with potential growth. No matter how you look at it, there's room to explore new places, characters, and pieces of history within the Avatarverse, and it looks like the series has a bright future ahead. On a recent official podcast all about Nickelodeon's beloved franchise, we get to hear directly from Michael Dante DiMartino and Brian Konietzko, the creators who brought all of this into existence. While well, they spent some time talking about The Last Airbender, and various storylines they would change, what really matters here is when they laid down the tracks for Avatar Studios. At first, they mentioned that all the new content will take a while to come out because it's just in the early stages. However, they soon teased what would come next. Mike and I have mapped out a very ambitious, multi-tiered plan to explore this big, rich, largely untapped history and future in the Avatar world, Konietzko explained. Each of these projects has its own feeling, its own tone, and look, so it will all feel true to the Avatar world but they will all be very different expressions of it, so it will really deepen it and expand it," he added later in the podcast. We're coming in now, and we have unprecedented support from Nickelodeon, so it is the franchise, the shows and animated stuff, but also other stuff beyond, in publishing, and in podcasts like you're doing, and all that stuff," said Martino. We have all the ideas, and ideally we're going to get to, over the years, explore all of them and get to make them, but it'll take some time. If we make all this stuff, you guys will just be podcasting for about the next 20 years or so, Martino teased. You heard that right. If all goes as planned, new Avatar content will exist in some form until roughly the 2040s. It's a number so far off, but that gives you a sense of how confident the creators are in telling more stories. To give you some perspective here, the last Airbender's first episode aired in 2005, 16 years before now. This means there's going to be way more Avatar in the coming years than there have been in the past, and I could not be happier about that. Of course, we should also talk about the elephant in the room, Nickelodeon. They're supportive of the franchise right now, but a lot can change in two decades. Viewers may eventually get tired of the shows and movies, constantly looking back to the original series and wondering if things will ever be as good. There's a chance that in time, people will grow tired of the Avatarverse, and we know how Nick is when it comes to shows that don't meet their expectations. Oh, I forgot. You're broken. I don't want to play with you anymore. Let's just cross our fingers that Michael and Brian's vision comes true because it could be an absolute game changer for Western animation. More updates will be available soon, but as of right now, all you need to know is that Avatar isn't going anywhere. Are there any specific characters or settings you want to explore in the upcoming shows? Who do you think is going to make a comeback? Let's talk in the comments. But anyway, that's all for this video. Subscribe for more awesome cartoon videos. Give a thumbs up and come up below let me know what you think. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.